Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around July 1st, okay? Now, keep in mind that the timing is fluid and not every reading is for you. All right. What do we have for around the 1st? Keep in mind the timing is fluid. I'm sorry that I got to keep repeating that. Some people just haven't learned it yet. What do we have for a message today? What's coming? I feel like there's some good news that is arriving. I do. I, I, I do. Um, hmm. Five of Pentacles. Somebody, but this is, uh, you know, it's, it's cold out here. It's cold. It's cold, but inside there is warmth, okay? So I feel like we have somebody here that is has been abandoned and they, they're seeing some sort of light. They're seeing an opportunity. They're about to get some help. I, I feel like we have somebody here that is about to get some help. And, and if they're, they, it feels like a bit, they could be lost. It feels like somebody could be lost. Six of Swords. I mean, this is help as well. Take somebody is getting some help. This is this is help. It's it's help arriving. Somebody is is getting help. They're going to be going to a better place. They're that's traveling away from a troublesome situation, headed towards peace and serenity. You know, headed to a better place. We do have somebody here that has been in a predicament where they haven't been taken care of by the looks of things or they've been struggling and there's some sort of help. They're headed towards something better and there's somebody here that is going to be helping them. It's like, come on, I'm gonna help you. Let's go. So somebody is, is definitely headed in the right direction and there's help here. Somebody is gonna be there's somebody is gonna be receiving assistance in some way. Strength reversed. Mm. That's weak. That's weak. It's weakness. It's fearful. Somebody is scared of, they're scared of something. Magician that is taking action right next to the strength card reversed. Uh, getting what you asked for. This is a yes. Healing is needed because strength card is about healing. It's also the strength to let go, the strength to go. This could be a graceful exit as well or a not so graceful exit. Um, because the strength card is reversed. Feeling vulnerable. Somebody needs help. They do. They need help. And they're going to receive it. They are going to receive it because there's help here. They're going to get what they're going to get. They're going to get what they asked for because the magician is about, you know, if you're willing to shed the old to bring in the new, and if you take action, you take those steps, you know, you're going to get what you asked for. So that is that is as above, so below. There's resources here. Somebody is going to be gaining some sort of resources because they take action and they seek out the path that leads them to, you know, a better place because the Six of Swords is going to a better place. It's moving on from some sort of turbulent situation where there's been a lot of waves and struggle and trouble but there's some sort of weakness here, feeling vulnerable or feeling inadequate, maybe even depressed with the strength card reversed. You may have somebody here that is depressed, they're ill maybe, they do need help. Maybe they need their confidence boosted. You know, maybe they need a confidence boost. This is a lack of self-esteem, a lack of self-confidence, a lack of uh, strength, inner strength. 
we do have somebody here that is, is headed towards uh, success because the magician does whatever they have to do to bring success. So there is success here. And before I started this reading, before I turned on this camera, I saw the Six of Wands. So the Six of Wands is progress, it's victory, it's leadership, it is uh, public recognition, uh, being recognized, somebody that is very noble, that is all done fighting, all done playing games, the battle is over. This is somebody that is, is headed towards success. There's nothing, there's no, it's over. Something is over. They're getting, they're getting what they deserve. Sixes are about balance. They are going in the right direction, taking the steps. Sixes are the journey to balance and harmony. And, it, and it's typically not very easy because you do have to. Fives are about struggling and their power struggles. Fives come in changes. So fives come before the sixes. So somebody has been struggling with changing. And the five of pentacles is the first card out. So any, and then we go to the six. So anyway, we do have somebody here that has been struggling. They have not been treated fairly. They have not been treated fairly. They've been neglected. They've been abandoned or uh, just discarded in some way. You know, um, maybe they're even lost. Like I said, it feels like we have somebody here that is about, it's like they see the light, they see an opportunity for help and they're gonna go get the opportunity. And, and whoever is giving them the opportunity is going to help them. They're gonna help them to succeed. We have some, the magician is somebody that is very gifted, very, very skilled, that has a lot of resources, that has a divine connection, that believes. So we have a believer here that believes, you know, that they can create and that they can do anything. So we do have somebody here that is creating something. But that strength card reverse, that is, that's, that's, oh, we got justice. Justice is about getting what you deserve. It's about doing the right thing. Everything turning out as it should. Making a fair and just decision. Truth being revealed. Truth coming out. Balance being restored. There's been some sort of, if you notice in this deck, the scales are unbalanced. Okay? So there's some sort of balancing that needs to happen. But it only comes with the truth. It comes with acting with integrity and doing the right thing. So we do have somebody here that has to do the right thing to balance out the scales to get what they deserve. And it will require perhaps asking for help or accepting help or moving, moving, because Six of Swords could be moving, traveling in a new direction, and, and replacing that fear with faith. Maybe that's why the Strength card reversed is here. It's, that's fear. Extremely scared. You know, that's fear. Weakness. But taking action with the with the Magician card. That is, this is a doer. This is somebody who is going to do whatever they got to do. And I feel like they're receiving an offer of love. They're receiving the tools that they need, whether it's um, well, this is a gift. Of, we have all the we have the Ace of Cups, the Ace of Swords, the Ace of Wands, and the Ace of Pentacles. So somebody is receiving. Well, there, there's a gift here. We also have a very gifted individual here. Um, that is receiving all the resources that they need. There's love, there's passion, there's truth, there's honesty, there's power, there's success, there's, there's a, a stable, solid opportunity right here. But there is a need to take action because the, the magician has to take action and believe. You have to believe that it's going to work out. So... You have to have faith. Page of Cups. I know that there's love around or, you know, there's 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 an offer of love. Somebody is going to receive a message of love. Somebody is being brought an opportunity that is very, oh, it's emotionally fulfilling. It's going to make them happy. Now, this is a message of love or an offer of love or... 
you know, showing feeling. Somebody could be love struck. If something just happens all of a sudden, you notice it just gets dropped right in your lap. Doves are a symbol of love, so there's a message of love here. There are love. There's has to do with love. Wheel of Fortune, positive change. This is the end of a cycle, the beginning of a new cycle, the end of a chapter. Tens are completions, so we do have the end of a chapter here. Spinning in a new direction, moving in a new direction. Somebody is definitely moving. They're moving to a better place, or they're they're accepting help from somebody that. It feels like they were, were reluctant to go in that path or go in that direction, but now they are. This is a positive, positive, positive change. Now, the Wheel of Fortune is destiny. It's meant to be. So we definitely have something here that is meant to be. Destined change, of course. The end of one chapter in the beginning of another. Now it's reversed because you know how it goes when I shuffle, it's just the way it is. But it does it does require ending a previous, putting the brakes on, saying no, stopping going backwards. Somebody has been going backwards, they have been delaying, they have been stuck, they have not been able to end that previous chapter. Oh, world reversed on the bottom. I mean, come on now, I didn't even, I just looked. What just came out of my mouth? This is lack of of um, it's stuck. It's 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 lack of closure or leaving without saying goodbye. Somebody may need to leave without saying. I mean, I hate to say that I do, but the the world card reversed is lack of success. It's uh, repeating negative pat patterns, staying in the present living in the present, not focusing on the future, not learning a lesson, uh, staying put. The journey is over. The, 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 that phase is over. It's done. There's a need to step into new territory. Somebody is neglecting. It feels like a partnership that is meant to be. And they're in, they, maybe they've been in a, a partnership that isn't meant to be with the Wheel of Fortune. And we had upright. Now it's reversed. The world card reversed is... flogging a dead horse somebody has been you know it's over it's done there's a there's a phase there's a chapter there's a there's a project there's a something that was very prominent that came into somebody's life to teach them a lesson maybe it was strength courage anyhow teach them a life lesson and they haven't learned their lesson they but they haven't this is a lesson not being learned but there's an opportunity to learn that lesson if you take action right now. The magician is about taking action to bring success. It's going to have to be replace your fear with faith. Step into that new world. Step into that new territory. You know, end that previous chapter that has been causing you de delays and causing you trouble and causing you turbulence and leaving you out in the cold. And, and we have it starts out with the five of pentacles. This is like. It's cold. This is a cold situation where, you know, there's loneliness, there's abandonment, and there's an opportunity to go to a better place, but you're going to have to replace your fear with faith. Anyhow, I do believe that there is some sort of emotional news that is coming. Uh... Well, the Page of Cups is, an, is welcome. It's a welcome opportunity for love it's also you know that dove is bringing somebody an opportunity for love there's an opportunity that you are going to love if you take action and go towards it you will have to face your fears and believe and have faith Queen of Wands could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We also have Gemini here and Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We also have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. We also have, we have everybody. We have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn as well. We do have somebody here that has been 
left out in the cold. They're about to receive some sort of offer, whoever this person is. It's like they are. This person that has been left out in the cold is well, who has been abandoned or neglected or something like that is about to receive some help. Help is arriving. This is somebody that is very kind and, and loving. The person that is offering the help is, is, a, is a lover. This could be something coming back around. Maybe this person was scared. It could, it's something may not be over. There could be some unfinished business here. Somebody could be coming back around. Three cards just fell out. The Knight of Wands. That is fast action. Something happening very, very fast. This is a passionate entrance of some sort. Somebody gets this vision. They get this desire. It's a very sudden desire. This is a fearless individual, typically. This is somebody that is just going to go for it. This is fast, very fast moving energy. The death card. Death cards are endings, endings that lead to new beginnings. This is a profound life change. And the eight of pentacles, putting in a lot of effort. We do have somebody here that is going to be uh, putting in a lot of effort. This person has been working on ending something by the looks of things. They've been putting in, they've been working really, really hard at other things as well. Um, maybe they've been, you know, focusing on their job or they've been um, busy, 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 busy. Somebody has been really, really busy. But things are about to change because death is a card of change and that's a fact. So we have a change that is coming and it's going to come fast. Very, this is like, you put that, that's sudden ending. Endings always, always, always lead to new beginnings. It's just the way it is. So, and this is a new direction. This is exciting. Very, very, very exciting. So things are going to change really, 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 really fast. We have somebody here that wants a new life. That that Knight of Wands is somebody that has a desire for a new life. They do. And there's romance in the air with all these roses on the Magician card and on the Strength. There's romance here. We have we have somebody here that is gonna be smiling. They are absolutely gonna be smiling because they're gonna be receiving an offer that makes them, or or help, but I don't know what this help is. They're gonna be receiving something that puts them in a place of, it feels like serenity. It's like, oh, yay. You know, I just feel like it's so peaceful. This is peaceful. I just feel like it's peaceful. Thank you that kind of thing. I just want to say thank you. It's like a hero, right? This is this is a hero. This is a saving the day. I feel like we have somebody here that is coming in really, really fast. This person is going to uh, help. They're going to help to, I don't know, this person's putting things on the wall. So I don't, I mean, our, that's what it looks like to me. We got somebody here that is hanging things up, putting things up. Um, Maybe even taking things down. This is creating. We have a creator here. We definitely have a creator here that is creating, you know, something new. And they're going to be doing it with another person because I know they, they, that they are. This is not alone. Okay. This is, this is, this is exciting. It's, 
fast changes. Things change really, really fast. This is what you asked for. Yes, the magician is yes. This is what you asked for. There's a lot of passion here. There's a lot of growth. This is, this is very attractive. This is going to be a very, very attractive offer or entrance or arrival. Somebody is arriving. This is uh, the beginning. It's, it's the beginning of, I feel like it's the beginning of something, I want to say beautiful. So, good luck. 